All right, thanks, Kate. A Brindley Mountain High School basketball player remembers his childhood school after it was destroyed by that EF2 tornado. You are taking a look at video from the Way 31 Sky Tracker of the damage. The school is canceled for the week, but extracurricular and sports activities are still a go. Way 31 Stephen Dulcizian joins us live outside of the school. And tonight, many, many community members filled the bleachers, showing their support during this difficult time, Stephen. Yeah, guys, this community is embodying a certain motto, Brinley Strong. Those two words mean a lot to people out here in this portion of Marshall County as they continue to recover after this tornado took basically an entire school out from the community. The tornado was a big talking point to a lot of people out here at the Brinley Mountain High School during the basketball game. And I was able to catch up with one of the actual players who said this was on his mind. We're ready to show our community what we're able to overcome in this hard times. Nick Nepper is a senior at Brinley Mountain High School, but years ago he was a kid playing on the playground at Brinley Mountain Primary. The school was damaged by an EF2 tornado over the weekend. The National Weather Service tracked winds as fast as 120 miles per hour. It hurt me at first because I'm the last class to have went to Union Grove, which is now the primary, and it really devastated our hearts and stuff because we are all. Really, a lot of us are really from that school, and it, it hurt our background of our history. Nepper says it's difficult not to think about it. The Marshall County School Board declared a state of emergency on Monday and is asking for financial help from the state. Seth Kelly teaches at Brinley Mountain High. He coaches and even went there himself. He says all that matters is everyone is safe. Well, what we're counting is a blessing that nobody was there. We're thankful that we have this building here that we can service them with on our campus. As Nepper warms up for a showdown against New Hope, Win or lose, he says this game means more. We'll definitely have a chip on our shoulder for this one. Now, Brinley Mountain fell to New Hope tonight. Final score 55 33. All extracurricular activity sports are still a go throughout the entire week, even though school is canceled for the week. Reporting live at Brinley Mountain High School, Stephen Dilsizian, Way 31 News.